If you are looking to get better open and click-through rates and you're a MailChimp user, you have to watch this video. Hi, my name is Hanne from Thrive Teams and in this video I'm going to show you one of the easiest ways to get higher engagement from your email list. The fastest way to get better results with your email marketing is by sending targeted messages to your subscribers. This means that not every subscriber will receive the same email, but rather get messages that are tailor-made for them. Splitting your subscribers into different groups is called list segmentation. And one of the reasons most people are not taking advantage of this feature is because it is difficult to set up. To segment your list in MailChimp, you have to create groups and every time you want to add subscribers into a certain group, you need to make sure that they subscribe to a different opt-in form. Creating these different opt-in forms and adding them to your website is a real hassle and super time-consuming. That's why most MailChimp users do not segment their list properly and miss out on this huge opportunity. At Thrive Teams, we love to help you get better results with your email marketing. And that's why we made it super easy in Thrive Leads to segment your MailChimp list. This will allow you to send different broadcast emails based on the group your subscriber is in, or you could even start an automation workflow when somebody joins a certain group. I hope you start to see how powerful this is. Let me show you in this quick tutorial how you can add your subscribers to different groups on your MailChimp list right within Thrive Leads. To use this feature, you need to have Thrive Leads installed and you need to connect your MailChimp account through the API connections. This is pretty straightforward and if you haven't done it already, you can look at the tutorial to connect MailChimp through API. Next, you will need to go to your MailChimp account and to the list that you want to segment. Click on the name of the list and go to Manage Subscribers and then to Groups. Here you will be able to create different groups. Click on the Create Groups button. You'll see this screen and you can completely ignore the first options because this is about how the groups will be shown if you use the MailChimp built-in opt-in forms, which we are not going to do because we are going to use our Thrive Leads forms. So just leave the first one checked and then you have to go to the group details. The first thing you have to do is to decide what will be the name of this group and next what will be the different subgroups to which the people will subscribe. So imagine you want to segment your list into different groups depending on the level of expertise they have. In this case you can give a group title that's called level and you will have different groups under this title. So for example you can have beginner and advanced. You can add as many groups as you want. Click on save and done for now. As you can see, the group is now created and we can go back to Thrive Leads. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will take a multi-step template. This is not at all necessary, but it shows very well what you can do with groups and how powerful this feature is. Let's go to the multi-step templates and choose this one. As you can see, this is a light box that first presents two options to your subscribers. They will be able to choose if they are beginner or if they are intermediate. To make sure that you will be able to use this information to send broadcast emails only for beginners or only for intermediate, or to start a workflow automation based on this information, you will have to make sure that the different people go into different groups in your MailChimp list. Go to state 1, this is the opt-in form that is connected to the first button, so in our case to the beginner button, and click on the opt-in form. Here you can see connect with service. Choose create a new connection, API connection, and select MailChimp. From here you can choose the different lists you have in your account and so this one was the group's tutorial list and as you can see you can choose your grouping. So we created the group level and now we are able to select if the people who submit this form go onto the group beginner or onto the group advanced. So in this case we choose beginner. Save. Here you can choose if you want to show or not the first name and click save again. Let's save these changes. Now let's connect the second opt-in form to the advanced group in your MailChimp list. 
first of all, let's call this advanced. And go to state 2 to change the opt-in form. Click again on the opt-in form, connect with service, create a new connection, through API, for MailChimp, select your list, your grouping, and your group. That's how easy it is with Drive Leads to add new subscribers to a certain group on your MailChimp list. It only takes a few seconds. When people arrive on your website, they will first see this light box and they will be able to choose their level of expertise. Once they clicked on the button, they will be able to give their email address and they will be added immediately to the correct group on your MailChimp list. Now, when you go to MailChimp and you look at your subscribers, you will be able to see that they've been added to a group. So this one has been added to the group beginner. This will now allow you when you send an email to your list to choose to send your campaign only to a certain group. So you can choose different groups, so the level, and here you can select that you only want to send this email to the group beginners. Or you can use the power of automations and on list activity, decide to send an automation when somebody joins your list group. Now I used the multiple choice light box in the first example to segment your list, but this is absolutely not necessary. You can choose yourself to which group you want to add your subscribers. Let's say you know that this offer is more of a beginner's offer. In this case, you can just choose to add the people who subscribe to this opt-in form to the beginner's list. I really hope you like this new feature in Thrive Leads and that you will use it to get better engagement with your email list. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them below.